Hello everyone, uh, it's local watch guy here. Um, it's a beautiful day today, so I just thought why not record this outdoors and also take a nice walk and get some exercise in. So today's review is going to be about the Swatch uh, Big Bold Jellyfish, I believe it's called. And it is a quartz movement. As you know, Swatch is known to make their quartz movement. Now, the reason I got the Swatch uh, may be obvious. Now, some of you know I am a huge fan of skeletonized watches. And it's just absolutely gorgeous. And the rubber strap is extremely, extremely comfortable. Um, my only, uh, I would say, flaw of this watch is the size. It is an absolutely huge watch, but nevertheless, it is absolutely beautiful and the yellow seconds hands just adds a completely different contrast to it very cheap very fun watch you know don't take it too serious could be worn on any occasion except formal occasions i would guess so when i first got this watch i actually was put on a waiting list and i know what you're thinking why have a waiting list for a swatch and it was actually completely sold out uh, where i lived and I had initially ordered two and it's just an absolutely fun watch to own that's why I got two I don't usually record videos outdoors but as I've mentioned today is a beautiful exceptional day to just go outdoors and enjoy you know the beautiful sunlight and explore my beautiful city so we'll be heading back inside and hopefully continuing off this review and get some great macro shots as well. If you are new to this channel, I am the local watch guy and I have been collecting watches since 2018. And I love all sorts of watches and I respect majority of the brands out there. If you want to see more cool reviews and unboxings, go ahead and hit that subscribe button as well as the notification icon as it really helps the channel. When I first saw this watch online, I knew I had to get it immediately. As a matter of fact, this watch was so fun to own and wear, I bought two. One is for collection purposes and the other is to be worn. I believe the retail price is around $110, which is around 33 Kuwaiti dinars. It is incredibly easy to change the time on a quartz watch, and all you do is pull out the crown and adjust the hours and minutes, and when you're done, simply push the crown back in. I've been a huge fan of Swatch and I've loved them ever since I was a kid. And my first watch ever was a Swatch and it was actually bought to me as a birthday gift at around the age of 11. Now this piece right here is called the Big Bold Jellyfish, coming from the family of Big Bold watches. It's called a jellyfish because of the transparent case and strap this watch has. I absolutely love the fact that everything is see-through and as simple as the movement is, it still impresses me every time I look at it. Gazing at the movement, you see all the steel details surrounded by hard plastic. You can even see the gears rotating as the seconds hand move, powered by the quartz oscillator. The hour hands is blue, the minutes hands is red, and the seconds hands is yellow. And this simple variety in colors gives the watch a very nice touch of difference. In the sense that if these colors weren't there, it would make the dial look a little bit dull. Based on my collection of watches, I prefer automatic watches to quartz. And there's a simple reason for that. I just can't stand the annoying sound of a quartz watch ticking. You can barely hear it if you're outdoors, but if you're in a quiet room, there's no doubt the ticking sound will most likely annoy you. However, it's hard to beat the precision of quartz watches. A quartz watch will continue to run without the need of a battery swap, and swapping the battery every couple of years to keep this fine timepiece running seems a little bit fair. Since this watch has a transparent case back, you'll notice the battery is on the back of the watch. This watch is also water resistant up to 3 bar, which is around 30 meters. 
The rubber strap on this watch is extremely comfortable and is friendly to overly hairy wrists like mine. It is also extremely durable and flexible and super lightweight. And I will not have a problem wearing this watch for super long hours just because of how comfortable the rubber strap is. And I'm not surprised that this watch only weighs 41 grams. Using the vernier calipers, you'll see that the watch has a case diameter of approximately 47 millimeters. So is this watch worth buying? Absolutely. It tells the time accurately and looks unique and is friendly to kids and adults as well. It's a fun watch and my only wish is that I wish it had sapphire crystal instead of the plastic or glass and I'm not really sure but it seems like hard plastic. Now I know it seems silly to do that based on the price of the watch but as I said it's only a wish. But overall I really recommend this watch. It's completely fun to wear if you're going to the beach or on you know simple casual occasions. That is all for today. Thank you for watching. Stay tuned and don't forget to subscribe.